tonight, the cost of heating your home is going up. Households that use natural gas will pay about 28% more this winter compared to last year. This comes as the fight against climate change is coming to your kitchen. New research shows emissions from gas stoves are helping to warm the planet, and that's why some cities are now banning them. Here's CBS's Ben Tracy. When Josh Skipper and his wife Kristen cook up lunch for their kids, that blue flame on his gas stove does not give them a warm feeling. I need to cook for my family, but I don't want to do it to the detriment of their futures. All of the natural gas used in homes and businesses accounts for about 13 percent of the United States planet warming greenhouse gas emissions. Climate is the biggest uh, concern. It's the thing that keeps me up at night. So Gipper let researchers from Stanford turn his Denver home into a makeshift science lab. A lot of big fancy boxes. Previous Stanford research found leaks from gas stoves alone produce planet warming pollution equal to half a million gas powered cars each week. Natural gas can also raise levels of nitrogen dioxide, potentially causing respiratory issues, including asthma. When you guys went in there and turned on the burners, how quickly did that reach a limit that's considered unhealthy? It took about uh, six minutes for the nitrogen dioxide level to, to reach that EPA threshold. But the fight over gas appliances is heated. While dozens of local governments, including Los Angeles and New York, are moving to require new homes and businesses to run on electric appliances, about 20 states are now forbidding such mandates. The cost of natural gas is at a 14-year high, and there are subsidies in recent legislation for consumers to switch to electric appliances. But natural gas advocates claim it's still costly. This is a very expensive proposition for very little environmental gain. Josh Gipper says he's just responding to this sign that his nine-year-old son recently made. As a millennial, and now that we're raising kids, like. No one else is taking care of this problem. It's time for us. Here's your grilled cheese. Ben Tracy, CBS News, Denver. Yeah.